pi. Today, we want to go through a question on binomial expansion. You are given, expand the expression 1 plus a half x power 5, then you are told to use the first three terms of the expansion to estimate the value of 1 and a half power 5. So, to expand this uh, binomial expansion, we say, we start by drawing this box here. Here, we get the constant terms of 5, of power 5. And to get these constant terms, you can either use the Pascal's triangle or you can use your calculator here. So the first one, you say the power is 5, so 5 combination 0 to get a 1. The next one, you say 5 combination 1, you get a 5. The third one, you say 5 combination 2, you get a 10. Then 5 combination 3, you get a 10. Then 5 combination 4, you get a 5 and eventually a 1. Then in the second column, you have the first term which is 1. In the third column, you have a half of x like that. So, the first term 1 here starts from the highest power, which is 5, going down to power 0. So, 1 power 5 is 1. Then 1 power 4, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1. Everything will be 1, 1, 1, 1. It will not have any change. Then, the second term, which is a half x, you start from power 0 going all the way to power 5. So, a half x power 0, a half x power 1, a half x power 2, a half x power 3, a half x power 4, a half x power 5. Remember to bracket this term here. Then from there you get the product. For example, you take the first row, you multiply everything. 1 times 1, a half x power 0 is a 1, you get a 1. The next one is 5 times 1 times a half, you get 5 over 2 of x. The next one is 10 times 1 times a half x squared. This one is 1 over 4 x squared. So 10 over 4, which is the same as 5 over 2 x squared. Then this row here, uh, this a half x power 3 is the same as 1 over 8 x power 3. So this will be 10 times 1 times 1 over 8 to get, if you divide by 2, you get 5 over 4 x power 3. Then the next one, a half x power 4, this is the same as 1 over 2 power 4 is 16 x power 4. So this is 5 times 1 times 1 over 16 to get 5 over 16 x power 4. And the last one, 1 times 1, 1 over 2 power 5 is 1 over 32 x power 5. So that will give us 1 over 32 x power 5. Once you have gotten this, you must now translate your answer here to get 1 plus 5 over 2 x plus 5 over 2 x squared plus 5 over 4 x power 3 uh -huh. you add here 5 over 16 x power 4 then 1 over 32 x power 5 part b after you have gotten the expansion of 1 plus a half x to b this one here you have been told to use the first three terms of the expansion to estimate the value of 1 
and a half power 5. So the first three terms are this is the first term, second term, the third term. So you are using up to that point, which is 1 plus 5 over 2x plus 5 over 2x power 2. To estimate, to estimate 1 and a half power 5. So what you do, you take the original expression, which is 1 plus a half of x, you equate it to what you are solving, 1 and a half. So this is a half x. If you take this one on this side, you get a minus, so a half. And therefore x equals to 1. With this one here, substitute it in this expression here to get 1 plus 5 over 2, where you have x, substitute with 1 here, plus 5 over 2, 1 squared. And if you work out, this will be 1 plus 5 over 2, plus 5 over 2, which would give us a 6. And that is the answer.